Hi, I'm Robert. Welcome to the Cruze Tech Lab. In this video, we'll discover Cruze's new Searline plug-in timers. They're in a compact size and designed to be quick and easy to use. Please join me and we'll take a look at the product and learn how to use it. We can select from an 8-pin or an 11-pin timer with the classic functions on delay, off delay, and repeat cycle, or we can choose a multi-function timer with all the classic functions, plus more functions. In this demonstration, we will use an 11-pin multi-function timer. This timer series has universal power input from 12 to 240 volts AC or DC and can be programmed from 0.5 seconds up to a 10-day delay. So you don't need to worry about selecting a specific voltage or a specific time delay setting. When you take the timer from the box, you'll see that it's smaller than standard timers you see in the field. So not only does it save valuable panel space, it's also full of functionality. Here you see helpful product information like the part number, connection diagram, function diagrams, and UL and CE safety certifications. The product has a cover to protect the dials from being accidentally moved. And for further security, you can place a cable tie or a wire loop through the hole here. The timer is super easy to configure. One dial allows you to select a time from half a second to 10 days. And another dial allows you to select the desired value within that time range from one to 10. Changes are quick and easy using your fingers, or a screwdriver. To select one of the many basic functions, we use the third dial to choose functions like A for on delay, C for off delay, and so on. Use the fourth dial to select the optional AD function, or the operation of a second relay, which can work instantaneously with a power supply or with a selected function. The LEDs make it easy to view the status of the product. The first LED indicates output status, and the second LED indicates status of the timer. Now I'll quickly demonstrate operation of the product. We will quickly configure the timer to use off delay function C, which will turn off the outputs when a desired time passes after we push the trigger switch. Let's demonstrate with a three second off delay. First, we will select 10 seconds for time range, and then the number three for the three second off delay. Lastly, we want both outputs to operate together. Okay, we're ready. Let's turn on the power. And after three seconds, I stop pressing the switch and both outputs should go off in three, two, one. There you have it. Both outputs turned off in three seconds. I'll demonstrate another function with different timing. First, we'll turn off the power supply and we'll select function AD. Let's increase the delay to four seconds. And now when we turn on the power supply and press the switch, we'll see the lights come on four seconds after pressing the switch. Four, three, two, one. I hope you found this video useful. If you have questions, need price or availability, or information on how to contact Cruze's Design Lab, see the information box below for helpful links. Please share your feedback and comments with us, and we hope you'll subscribe to our YouTube channel. And also, we hope you'll recommend this video to others by clicking the like button. Thanks for visiting the Cruze Tech Lab, and don't forget to check out our other videos.